Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Brianna from BriannaLentz.com and today what I wanted to do was open up this Dimensions Gold Collection Petites Chickadees in Spring kit with you. I got this for Christmas of 2020 and it is spring and I really wanted to work on this this year but I haven't gotten to it yet and I finally finished my last spring project and so I want to go ahead and open this up. So it says that this is chickadees, as you can see. They have a couple different chickadees kits. I really liked this one. I thought this would go well with my decor. Um, my daughter's got this for me, like I said, for Christmas. And this is stitched on 16 count gray Ada. And the design is by Bradley Jackson. It is five by seven. And let's open it up and see more of what's inside. So as you can tell, I have not opened this yet. This is brand new. Oh, I love it. I love it, I love it. So here are your thread organizers. colors. They are so pretty. This just screams spring. Oh my goodness. Not to sound cheesy, but it does. I love this. This is really bright. This is really fun. So there you go. Lots of pinks, lots of blues, lots of greens. And here is our 16 count gray Ada. Not a huge piece of working material, which is fun. Um, this, like I said, this is supposed to be five by seven. So let me lay the colors on top so you can get an idea. Love that. You have your instructions. I won't be showing you the chart. Ooh, dropped my needle. Dropped the needle. Here is the needle that comes with the kit. Okay, and after looking at the chart, the chart is the height of this paper. The height is pretty much this big with a little bit on top. So that's the size of your chart and it is easy to read. It's easy to see. The back stitching that they have on it is really easy to, to discern. Um, they have cross stitches, half stitches, back stitches, French knots, combined colors, and unstitched fabric. And let me fold this over so you can see. These are all of the full crosses and then here are the half crosses it says and here is the color key for the back stitches i hope it's helpful to you without seeing the the pattern of course but oh i like that i really want to get started on this right now i'm going to be making a working copy because i have a i've Completed one dimensions kit already um, and I love it. And I did not make a working copy of that. And then I have another petite that I'm working on. I think it's like Moonlight Cabin or something like that. I have, I'll link down below the unboxing video to that because I'm currently working on the same kit that I unboxed last year. Um, and I didn't make a working copy. And having not visited that project for a while coming back, it's a little confusing. And I wish that I had made a working copy to then have like the original copy to kind of look back on and kind of like make sure I didn't make any mistakes. Um, so I will be doing that in the future. Not, um, and I will keep the pattern. I'm not going to give that away or anything like that, but I think that'll be easier for me. Um, 
I love this. Oh gosh, this looks like so much fun. And my only regret is having not opened this and started this sooner. So I hope this was helpful to you guys. Um, let me know in the comments down below, have you stitched chickadees in spring before? Are you currently working on chickadees in spring? Is this something that you're looking forward to working on? Um, if this has helped you see what will come inside the kit and has uh, inspired you or enabled you to purchase it, let me know down in the comments below. Please hit that like button if you liked this video. Please subscribe. Also, I'll have um, links to my website down below in the information box that'll take you to other uh, projects that I have on my website. I have a lot of videos on crochet, cross stitch, floss tube. I, I'm like 14 videos in at this point on my floss tube channel. The same channel, I just upload floss tube videos. Um, anyway, I hope you guys are having a great week, you guys, and I hope you have happy stitching, and I'll see you guys in the next project. Bye.